agent? Or is it just Mike Thornton now, with the rank stripped away? Never understood why we had titles anyway. Meaningless. I don't understand why you wanted to speak to me. If you think I can help you, you're wrong. We'll see. I think you'll want to hear what I have to say. Parker, the plan you arranged with Halbeck, it's not gonna work. Really? Doubtful. I thought there was a chance you might return. You are resourceful. Even for a rogue agent. Well, I have you all to thank for being rogue, don't I? I thought it would just be a cover, but you made it real. If you blame me for this, then you're in error. Miss Tang is to blame. You're saying Mina gave me up? And she ordered the missile strike? The first was done by her, yes. The second was the result of orders we received. She was not responsible for that. I would have preferred you return here, where you could be monitored. As you can see, letting you run around is dangerous. And, well, despite your flaws, you are a valuable resource. I don't believe Mina would give me up. I don't care what you believe, but I have no reason to lie to you. Now, what do you want? There's little I can do for you, so make it quick. You're betraying your own country, Parker. Whatever you think you're doing, it's wrong. No, my country has authorized this, Mike. Although no one will ever know. If you think to appeal to my patriotism by defining it as betrayal, Halbeck's interests had to be protected because it's our national interests. So that makes Leyland in charge now? Of an entire branch of a U.S. agency? No. We were ordered to assist him in recovering his missiles, in assassinating Shahid, and then killing you. He was given access to the facility and our resources. But why? Why did we cooperate? There's no reason to ask why. You can't tell me that you didn't suspect something was wrong. Nothing was wrong, Thornton. As I said, Halbeck had proper authorization. They asked permission, and they got it. And Westridge didn't object? No, because like me, he follows orders. We were asked to get an agent to do Leyland's job and to contract me for my services. Services? What services? I was asked to isolate events in the world and create... triggers. While many of these triggers would benefit Halbeck, a great deal would benefit the United States. China grows more powerful by the day. They are Halbeck customers as well. And if they are reliant on Halbeck technology, they are reliant on us. Even better, if they can be lured into action in Taiwan, well, then it buys us time to build strength. And Moscow? Rome? Rome was a reminder to the rest of Europe. Moscow, a necessary distribution center. And the people on the airliner in the Middle East? Those deaths, they are nothing compared to the death toll that would follow if these steps were not taken. You're responsible for everything that happened. You gave them the plan for all of this. Sung, the museum in Rome, that airliner? Uh, I wouldn't expect you to understand, Thornton. But yes, the government asked me to design scenarios to promote America's position in the world, and to strengthen Halbeck as well. That was the most interesting assignment I've had in years. To use my analytical skills for something besides system maintenance or compiling budget reports. For a project of my own. So yes, I accepted the assignment. And I did what I do best. Analyze. Provided you had all the information. I did have all the information. No. No, you didn't. What you said about Moscow, that distribution center is shut down, and I found the real source there. Surkov's now working for me, and he has all the evidence I need to bring this place down. I know you well enough, Agent. I assume you have proof of this. You're a logical guy, Parker. With what I told you, how do you think this is going to play out? Your mistake's not going to look good on a field report, or the nightly news. But it doesn't have to be your mistake. I take it you have a plan? Yeah. You've been drafted. So you better start making yourself useful right now.